there guys time for another play along video with mrs steck i have the bell kit for this uh particular video we're going to go over notes and we're going to play through everything in this um we are not going to address um specific counting uh that's in another video um that i did that i put together for both page uh, 14 and 15 all of the counting for those two pages so we're just going to focus on notes and playing through today so let's go ahead and get started so we're going to start out on the note E flat for this one, and we're just playing the rhythm one, two, and three, four, over and over again. Okay, so let's go ahead. I'm going to pull this up once I hit play. Here we go. Playing through. Two, ready, go. Notice that I am pretty much, I'm mostly alternating between hands um, and I'm offsetting the mallets a little bit so that they're not right next to each other. This would be really hard to play and I would have to like go back and forth this way. This way I can keep the mallets over that note the entire time and just alternate back and forth. Let's do it again. We're going to turn the accompaniment on and I'm going to switch my lead hand. So I was leading everything with the right hand. Now I'm going to do it with the left. Here we go. Two. Ready, go. Shut up. That one's super easy. Okay, to the next. Number 50, Manoman Harvest. And I'm going to write out the notes on this one. So we've got C, 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 E flat, E flat, F, E flat, C, C, E flat, E flat, C, B flat. C, rest, C, rest. Then we go back. C, 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 E flat, E flat, F, E flat, C, then skip. <clears throat> e flat, C, 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 B flat, C, rest, C. Okay. Um, we'll go ahead and play through that once with no accompaniment and just the my part. All right, <clears throat> here we go. Two, ready, go. And if you need to slow it any slow it down any, um, go ahead and use the YouTube um, customization feature. All right, let's turn the accompaniment on. I'm actually going to bump down to 80 for this one because I didn't have, didn't realize I was a little above that. All right, here we go. Take two with accompaniment. Two, ready, go. On to the next. Another that uses only one note, so we don't really need to go through the note. All right, so we're on the note F, easy enough. No accompaniment, no my part. 
Yeah, we could do this in 92, I think. Easy, easy as pie. All right, here we go. Two, ready, go. with the accompaniment this time. Two, ready, go. And again, on to the next. We're just flying through these, which is appropriate because now we're going to do a piece called Now Let Me Fly. Let's go through the notes. My key signature tells me that all the E's are flatted and all of the B's are flatted. It does not matter that they're not on the same line. If the note has the name E, it is going to be an E flat. Same thing for the note B. So I've got E flat, E flat, C, B flat. It's a terrible B flat. C, E flat, E flat, E flat, G, E flat, E flat, C, B flat, C, E flat, E flat, F, E flat. Okay. Let's bump the tempo down because we've got lots more notes now. Let's go down to 80. Boop. No accompaniment, just the my part. Okay. Here we go. Two, ready, go. what happens when you are not looking at the notes. I kind of hit that G up here just a little bit instead of the F kind of hit in between them. So I ended up with two notes. So be careful as you're going through. Let's turn the accompaniment on and this time I won't do that. Two, ready, go. Didn't mess up that time. We all make mistakes, right? It's all good. To the next, number 53, sight reading challenge. This one had some special items in it for the counting. So this is the one we had to write the bar lines in. I'm not gonna do that today. Just gonna go through the notes, but I will show you kind of what it looked like before. So I had the one, two, and three, four. And you can kind of see that with the highlighting. It usually highlights one measure at the beginning. One and two, three, four. So you notice that every time I say the number four, the next thing I'm gonna do is write that bar line. The one exception is if I had eighth notes that were on beat four, but I don't have those. All right, so I've got D, B flat, B flat, C, D, E flat, E flat, F, D, rest, E flat, D, D, E flat, F, G, G, F, C, D, B flat, B flat, C, D, E flat, rest, G, rest, F, E flat, C, A, 
down low, B flat, B flat, B flat, and B flat. Okay, so real quick, I'm gonna note that A on my bell kit. I have one here and I have one up here. Okay, so this is the one that we're gonna play when we go down below the staff and we have the note that has one ledger line and then the second ledger line is going through the note. That's the note A for us, okay? So bump the tempo down, no accompaniment. My part is on. Here we go. Two, ready, go. And now, once again, with accompaniment, two, ready, go. On to the next. Last but not least, we have Rio con Rio. It will load in a minute. There it goes. Okay, so I'm coming to an off. We'll leave the my part on. Let's go through the notes. We're gonna bump that tempo down. Okay, so we've got D, 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 F, D, E flat, E flat, D, C that ties across to another C, 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 E flat, C, C, D, E flat, E flat, F, D, 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 F, D, E flat, E flat, F, G, F, D, F, F, E flat, C, C, A, B flat. And once again, the A is down underneath our B flat. Okay. Let's go ahead and give this one a shot with no accompaniment. Two, ready, go. All right, and let's go ahead and add the accompaniment. And this is the last thing on this page, guys. Here we go. Two, ready, go. And that is all for page 15. So the next time I see you, we'll be on the next page. And we are quickly progressing through this book. You guys are doing fantastic. All right. Have a great one, y'all.